Hello, hello, hello. Hello, everybody. I was fixing the microphone. Hello, everybody. Necro VMX here, and welcome back with more uh, Soul Blazer. Uh, I gotta pause. Let's. Hey, we're in the water shrine. Okay, yeah, that's what I figured. I figured before bed I got time for one more, right? That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do one more. All right, we're gonna be making our way over there. Uh, I know there's guys here. We do like, I think like this. Yeah, yas. <clears throat> Got him. Be annoying to approach those guys. All right, 150 gems, and there's still three monster layers left here, so, you know. <clears throat> hmm. Mm -mm 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 All right, I'm gonna get these mud dudes. What do I level up at? 2,000, okay. I better make sure that the... Yeah, that's equipped, okay. Because I'm not great health right now. Oh, God. I am watching over the world. Please take this. Experience points. Uh, we'll stay. Okay. <clears throat> Carol received medical herb. Well, that heals me. Oh, watch out. Carl released a mole. A voice is calling Carl from the hole. I am the creature who brings light to darkness. I will help you upon your return. And we're actually going to need that, because uh, the next area is really dark, so we're going to head there. There we go. Good luck. Talk with the stump. Please listen carefully. This is Greenwood. This land was developed by a dog named Turbo. He created this town so animals could come here and feel safe. If you find a particular mole, you'll be able to see in the dark. Make sure you talk to all the moles. Please, come take a walk with me. Sure. All right, let's go. Do, do, do. Mm -hmm. The island over there is a graveyard. My twin brother is the island guard. Mm -hmm. This place used to be the Green Theater. A group called the Woodston Trio used to be a very popular band. Thank you for walking with me. Oh, one more thing. We animals communicate not only with our voices, but also... If I step like this and wag my tail, it means thank you. Did you already know that? I did. We tell the trees what is taking place, and in turn, they give us seeds to eat. So I guess you could say we have sort of a give-and-take relationship. The birds tell me many stories. I am thankful for them, because I can't move from this spot. The birds tell me the Lost Side Marsh has three shrines. One is called Water, another is Fire, and the third is Light. Well, we've been in the Water Shrine already. <clears throat> Even though I don't look like it, I'm from the sky, just like you. I light up the darkness. You cheer up e everyone up. You cheer up everyone. Ugh. Let's work together to revive the world. The creature who lights up darkness joined Carl. By the way, why don't we go to the second basement of the water shrine? You will now be able to see monsters which you could not see without me. Yep. So that's new magic. Uh, wait, not magic. Is it magic? No. Oh, boy. 
No, I think it's just, I think it's passive. Anything else? I think that might be it, really. There's that treasure chest I haven't gotten. I think it's a bit before I can get that chest. Oh, I can go in here. Welcome to the Squirrel's Exchange Store. I'm hungry. If you can bring me something to eat, I will trade you something. Yeah, I think he gives you a sword, but I don't have... I don't have that yet. Alright. Fortunately, we gotta go through the whole thing again, because I didn't reach, like, a warp point or anything. Take these guys out. So you can see there's still five layers there, but Lost Side, we haven't... We have to go through the water shrine to get to the other parts of it. So here's the water shrine. Uh, let me just go up here and see if there's any... I think there's a... yeah. Oh god. So I'm pretty close to leveling. And drums, though. There we go. Damn it. And there are a few up here I wanna... So, this will level it up, I think, right? Yeah, because I'm getting 10 a pop. There it is, level up. So the next level's at 3,200 experience points. All right, moving on to the next area. Second. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, it's passive. The uh, ooh, light thing. Nah. It's hard to not get hit by those assholes when they do that. All right. Boom. Carl received delicious seeds. All right. Let's go back right now and cash that in for a sword. There is no reason not to. Oop, 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 oop. Ah, it's all right. Nope, oh, damn it. It's like the default is no, you know? Ah, I smell some delicious seeds. You have some, don't you? Oh, I have to, like, equip them. I will exchange this sword with you for the seeds. Carl received the Psycho Sword. Alright. Alright, so... See, that was the Sword of Life. This is the Psycho Sword, so... It's a level 5 sword. Invincible monsters are temporarily paralyzed. So, enemies that we couldn't hurt, we still can't hurt them, but we can stop them from moving briefly. Which can be useful. We still can't kill those enemies. And of course this thing does a lot more damage, too. Come on. Damn. What did I say? 3200? Yeah. Yeah, see there it says Soul of Light. Might as well, right? I don't see any reason not to.
Come on. Thought there was a third one, but I guess not. Alright, back to that second basement. Oh, he got me. How many are in here? Six, okay. Sweet. Oh boy. They're constantly in that animation. It's hard to hit them. Alright, go for it. Sweet! Okay. Car released a crocodile. That sounds dangerous. Alright. Carl found a strange bottle. Really? I was gonna say. Got him. Car released a squirrel. Two left. Mm. Yeah, this one's fake. And so is this one. All right. Car released a mole. No, I gotta do this first, I think. Carl found 50 gems. All right, so that's all the ones on this floor. All right. Damn. This is the last one here, right? Oh, okay. Carl released a deer. That's the last one on this floor. Uh, okay, hold on. Oh, God. Go ahead, Evan. Go, 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 go. All right, so now we're here on the first floor, and there's still one left here, so I'll have to look around for that. Uh-huh. You can see there's a treasure there. Come on. Oh. All right, so now we have, can go back and forth as we please. Let's get this. Oh, God. 50 gems. All right. So we're pretty much done with the water shrine. Okay, so this puts us out uh, back out on the... Oh, hello. Oh. Wasn't paying attention. 
the lakeside uh, marsh. Where there's still five remaining. Monster layers. All right, sweet. Carl released a dog. Here, no, okay. I've been seeing this one for a while. From the bottom half there. Oh god. Jesus Christ. Alright, sweet. And that's a shortcut. Which I will use to heal myself up, and then we're going to continue forward. Oh, right, they respawn. Because I left the area, technically. Two left, but I think we're done here, yeah. And I believe this is the Fire Shrine? Oh yeah, it's the Fire Shrine. So this is uh, part one of the Fire Shrine, and as you can see, there's um, five remaining. Oh, just give me a second here. Just looking at Discord here. <laughs> oh my... Thing three quarters? I don't get it. Sometimes be, people be saying things and I don't get it, you know? But whatever. All right, so here we are, Fire Shrine. So there's five on this... F oh, okay. See, these guys are invincible. We're not going to be able to do anything, but since we have the Psycho Sword, we can pause them briefly, but... All right. All right. This is probably the one for the Metal Scorpions, but we don't have the sword for that. All right, medical herb. Hmm. Ah. No, oh, both at the same time. All right, that caused the staircase to appear. And there we go. Car released a dog. Sweet. So two left, one that we know about, one that we can't reach. But let's go up here and go down here. Ah, okay, here we are. Nothing inside, because of course not. All right, now we have a staircase there. But we're not done yet. Uh, I can't get to that, but all right, should be one over here. Yeah. Level up. All right, so the next level up's at forty-five hundred. All right. Car released a squirrel. Okay. Let's 
still four left here. That might be for the these guys, because it's not spitting anything out. That one I can't reach. I'll still kill these guys for the experience, though. Right, we'll have to come back to that. Sweet! Car released a dog. There's the graveyard. Alright, more lizards. Oh, these are the ones that kind of vanish every once in a while. Damn it. Annoying ass enemies. There we go. Car released a crocodile, as you do. Okay, so we're gonna make our way back to the middle portion and continue further down. Watch out. Okay, so from here, let's see. Just trying to figure out exactly where I am. I think I know where I am, but I'm not entirely sure. Now we'll figure it out. Damn, they're hitting me more than I want them to. Carl released a mole. Alright, so you have to run across these when they're not super hot. Alright, there we go. Car released a squirrel. Seven left in this area. Go. Watch out. Probably could have made it to the second one, but that's okay. Head our way over there. Here, take this light arrow magic. Would you like to return to Greenwood? Uh, not yet, no. So now we have better magic. Uh, let's equip it. I'll show you what that looks like. Uh, sending fire in all sorts of different directions, you know? So that's pretty cool. So is this six left? Yeah, six. Jesus. Irritating ass enemies. Sweet. I don't think it goes anywhere, though, yet. Oh, it does? Okay, hold on, then. I'll go there first. But that just looks like... Yeah, you know, this one doesn't go anywhere. That just looks like it's uh, those metal enemies that I can't take care of yet. It's a while before you get the sword that can kill them, too. But I can take care of the lizard. Alright. 
Alright, so the, uh... The... Whatever's generating the metal enemies is somewhere else. This is for lizards. Oh, God. There we go. Alright, now I can do that part. Yeah, it's going to take damage there, no matter what. Carl found 100 gems! Sweet. Annoying. Alright. Yeah! Lizards. Doing the damn scorpion tanks is annoying now, you know? Ugh. Hold on. All, all kinds of wrong buttons. Gotta make sure I have this on just in case I need it. Yeah, stop it. Whew! Car released a bird. Game can be kind of stressful, even though I love it, you know? There's a bird sleeping in front of Turbo's gravestone. So we know it's sleeping, that means we'll use the dream rod when we get there. Alright. Alright, we got lava boys here. Car released a mole. I do like that you get like a little bit of health back with each one, you know. Car released a deer. Carl found 60 gems! Alright, I think that's for the metal scorpions. Alright. There's two, two here, but it's not like I can do anything here, so... I'm gonna go up here. That's just the way it is. And things will never be the same. Fuck. Alright, we can go back now. And let's go down here. Car released a squirrel. Alright, so that's pretty much all we could do in the fire shrine for now. Let's move on. And we're not going to be able to get very far here, so yeah, check it out. Carl began to hear a small voice. We are rafts made from the branches of trees in Greenwood. If you cannot prove that you are from Greenwood, we will not let you ride. Alright, so. We'll have to come back to that. So we're gonna head back to Greenwood. As well, right? Every little bit counts. That's fine. I'm gonna go that crazy going for it, right? Alright, um, let's see. 
I'm Billy, leader of the Woodston Trio. Our show is really exciting. I want to end it soon, but you know. Hello, I'm a member of the famous Woodston Trio. We usually have a variety show at this theater, but I'm missing my two sidekicks. They all think they're the leader. Alright. Um... Okay. I need to take a walk and work some of this food off. He just follows you, I think. I can tell when something is is just by its smell. All right, let me start doing my job. This is pretty funny if you follow him. From right, I smell fresh air. From down, I smell a mole. What is that smell? I smell something strange coming from up. It's around here somewhere. I smell something really strange. There's an outhouse. Oh, this is our bathroom. Thank you for walking with me. I'll tell you a secret. I can smell some armor north of here. Yeah, if I can get over there, that'd be great, but we can't do that just yet. Can't quite do it yet. Can Turbo the dog used to live with a human named Dr. Leo. Turbo learned a great many things from him. He used branches from the trees to make a tool called a raft. This is a restaurant. Would you like to see the menu? Yeah. Great. Let me tell you our special of the day. You! I'm just kidding. Please don't be offended. This restaurant is famous for delicious food and fruit drinks. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go in here. Boo! Come on, aren't you surprised? No. I've played this game before. There once was a raft made from the bark of my branches. You must find this raft. I believe it might be able to help you in some way. If you help me cross the river, I will give you something. Now, we haven't unlocked that just yet, so... You do that every time, aren't you? Dick. I'm always digging in the ground. Sometimes I dig up strange things. I just dug up some dog bones to lower right. I got scared and reburied them. Well, that's where the graveyard is, so... Uh, there's not much I can do here. Alright. I just want to finish this part, and then I'll end it. You must bring me something that once belonged to Monmo. I hear someone snoring. I cannot tell who is making the noise. Alright, this guy's sleeping. Ah, I wasn't trying to talk to you, sir. Carl placed the dream rod upon the stump. helps. Even though I am only a stump in real life, I often dream that I am a bird and can fly wherever I wish. Alright, that's a big help. Who are you? Are you trying to walk over me? Yes. You have some nerve. Okay, but don't hurt me. Dude, you're an alligator. I'm guarding the graveyard. I hear someone snoring, but can't tell which direction the sound is coming from. Right from this guy here. Here lies Turbo, builder of Greenwood. Carl touched the small bird with the dream rod. I'll do this first. All right, there we go. Carl, go to the light shrine and release the guardian of the woods. You will find what you are looking for. There is a bird tiki that may tell you how to use the raft. You must protect Greenwood now that I'm gone. You can go up there. There's not much point to it, though. Turbo, wait. Where's that other bird? I might have to wait for him. There he is. Oh, oh he's going over there. Well. Oh, he goes over there. Okay. Uh, well. Can now go back here. Car received ice armor. Okay, so. So. So we can now cross fire without taking a damage. But 
I'm not done here. Yeah, this guy. We tell the trees what it is taking place and in turn the area. I'm supposed to get the thing that proves that you're from Greenwood. The rats only carry the residents of Greenwood. Maybe if you bring something that used to belong to Turbo, they might help you. There are some leaves from Greenwood buried with Turbo. That's right, we gotta find where he was buried. Okay, so the problem is, is that he was dug up and reburied. Is that over here somewhere? I could be wrong. Yeah. I'm trying to remember exactly where it is. Oh, it's over there. You can actually see his bones. And we had to open this up in a dream to get here. The leaves of Greenwood are found under the dog bones. Alright, so we're going to stop right here. I'll see you guys real soon with more Soul Blazer.